My name is Rex Power Cole. I'm a Cyber Commando, Mark IV designation. My mission is to protect and serve the United States of America. For the past decade, the US of A has been at war with the Communist Empire of Vietnam. It's the fourth war we fought against them. But this one's different, because the Reds have managed to master Blood Dragon tech. I don't understand, and I don't give a shit how they did it. I'm just here to shoot people in the face. What I get is they're tapping blood dragons for energy and turning their blood into weapons, and that we can't stand. That's why they sent the best of the best of the best to end it once and for all. The one on the bike? That's not me. Rex Cold has been gone for nine years. That's one of my kids. You heard me. Kids. Twelve years ago, I fell for a lady. Dr. Elizabeth Darling, the most beautiful woman I ever saw. We got married, had twins together, a boy and a girl. Girl's name is Roxanne. She's a smart one. You want something done stealthy, with a light touch? You call her. And the boy here? Slater. Best rider I've ever seen. Totally fearless and a hell of a shot. Nine years ago, it all went to shit. My wife disappeared, left me, left us, without even a note. Just vanished. Me, I couldn't look at the kids, because every time I did, it reminded me of her. I looked for her everywhere, but no luck. She was gone. So I flew to Nam and I fought that damn war by myself. Guess what? I lost. I died. The Rex Colt you knew no more. The good thing was General Mason Ryback came along to take care of them once I was gone. Turned them into cyber commandos, too. Mark Six's latest tech, hiding all cybernetics under living tissues. It only makes sense for my kids to follow in daddy's footsteps. Like Slay there, on a mission to rescue POWs just like I would have. I couldn't be proud of what those kids are about to do. is of the utmost importance. Some of our soldiers have been taken prisoner by the VCOMs. We are America. We leave no man behind. Bring them home. Objective in NAM is simple, Corporal. We need to put down the commie's commander. If we rattle the cage enough, the beast will come out in the open. That will not be easy. He's a cautious man, but if we destabilize the region enough, that'll draw him out. He'll show his damn face, and after that, well, all we have to do is locate and terminate. In the end, it all comes down to this. We eliminate bad guys, and this one is no different. Carry on, Corporal.
Could you turn it down just a little, Slay? Some of us are studying for our next mission. Some of us are studying for our next mission. Whatever you say, Mom. I'm not your mom. I'm your sister. Okay, that was totally badass. If you'd studied, you'd have known how to dodge that. <laughs> you know, sis, for a total nerd, you're all right. <laughs> and for a bratty younger brother? By six minutes, you're okay, too. the enemy compound, hack their mainframe and find the location of their energy source. This gig is a stealth mission, and that means drop the bike as soon as you can. Clear? Clear. I just jumped over the fence, and I'm ready to hack away, sir. Really, Rox? A silencer? Why? To be a little something you never heard of. Discreet. Security level four reached. I have to admit it, I'm the best. Security level five reached and door open. Okay, Vox, we're almost there.
Yay! Ta-da! Access to mainframe computer granted. Sir, in five minutes, you'll have the exact location you were testing. Tumors. That's the V-Kongs are harvesting Blood Dragon's blood as an energy source. It accumulates in certain areas to form tumors. That's T-U-M-O-R-S. Plural. Your mission is to destroy the biggest one. Shoot any enemy who tries to stop you. Understood? Tell me, sis. Is understood with one O or two? <sighs> I think I just came up with a plan B to destroy the mother team. What's that? Go straight in, destroy everything I find on the way, and drive the vehicle directly into the tumor. Subtle. Right down your alley. I know, right? Can't help it if I got all the brains.
explosions. Are you all alright? All good. This is totally banging. Not only have we destroyed the tumor, but now the v punks are sleeping. They're ready to torch everything to kill the BD. It's beautiful. have made a deal with the Cali cartel. They want to flood our beautiful country with turbo crank, the most dangerous drug in the world. Well, you know what to do. Initiate the hunt, I find the bugs. Then I fumigate, eradicate, and exterminate. Spot on. You'll find the sprayer and your uniform in the package next to your right foot. Stay cool, Daddy O. Always have, always will. Ways up, that's always been my motto.
beeping? Your bike stalled or something? Hell no. My shit always works. Sometimes. I've got beeps. That means you're close. Now head back to street level first chance you get. I'm out front now. Don't forget, you have to clear each floor and then move up. I'll place charges for the grand finale. Already on it. Sorry for the guy who has to vacuum this place.
Lobby clean. Charge planted. Fireworks are ready. Meet me in the penthouse, Slay. Just let me finish mopping up first. <laughs> Looks like I'm on the cooking and packaging floor. There's turbo crank everywhere. Someone's in a kibble coma. Explosives in place. Charges are primed and ready. Rocks, grab the cat.
Where? Where are we? Hospital. You've been asleep for, like, centuries. Horrific mass shooting which resulted in 75 wounded and 16 dead. The latter being mostly drug traffickers. So that was Turbo Crank, right? We caused this? It was, and we did. This is wrong on so many levels, Slay. Yeah, yeah, I know. But you know, sometimes you gotta crack a few eggs to make an omelet. Yes, the fight against communism sometimes comes with a high price. And speaking of omelets, I've checked online. Inhaling that much turbo crank, our brains should have been like fried eggs. Instead, we're pretty much just fine. You're fine. You did your favorite thing in the world, read. I've been out for days, meaning I miss my cartoons. And that is whack. You don't understand. This is important. This means something. Then ask the general. He knows everything. You're damn right I do. General, general Ryback. Ryback. I'm sorry, but you can't smoke in here. What are you, some kind of communist? Get lost. Sir, you know what happened to us there, right? You know why we're fine. You've got to tell us. Now! Corporal Colt, you will change your tone when addressing a ranking officer, or I'll have your ass in a wood chipper. Turbo crank 12-year-old or not, is that clear? Yes, sir. Sorry, sir. Now listen up, you two. I know you're dying to know how you could hoover up that much of the drug and not get <laughs> worse than a cat at a Pink Floyd laser show. Well, I'll tell you. Is it because you dosed us with a super secret antidote? No. Is it because we've spent the last 10 years building an immunity to turbo crank? No. Is it because you- Corporal, would you just shut up? Here's the deal. I haven't been entirely honest with you two. You see, the reason you were able to suck down a Hollywood party's worth of turbo crank is that you're not entirely human. What? Bitchin. But if we're not human, what are we? Well, your dad, Rex, was human. Dr. Darling, your mother, well, she was a blood dragon in human form. Wicked! Damn right it's wicked, and it means you're tough. Tougher than anyone thought. So get up out of those hospital beds and get your combat socks on, because the commies are on the move. Identify the location of the Holy Grail. Mm -hmm. 